Oh, hello. Am I through to Masjid e Zanzibar? San Zanzibar? Am I through to the Masjid? Masjid e Zanzibar? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank you for your help. Um, I was given a copy of the Quran. I'm reading it. I'd like to know more. I've got questions about what I've been reading. Could somebody help me? Um, well, um, one of the things I'm curious about is what does the Quran say about the previous scriptures? Could you show me a Quranic verse, or what does the Quran say about the the Bible, the Torah, 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 and the Injil Gospel? Basically, they are the only book, Bible, uh, and the four books in it. So basically, all those books came to the Prophet, our holy, holy book, and it's, which, what, what sort of, a, I mean, what uh, translation are you reading? I'm reading the Halali and Khan translation, which I don't like at all. I think it's extremely un, un, unhelpful. It adds a lot of words to the text. It's not literal word for word. Are you reading the English one, or if... Uh, of which you can uh, understand, or uh, are you reading in the translation of Urdu? Well, I've just told uh, you. I'm, I've just told you I'm reading in the Halali and Khan translation, which is, I don't think, very good because it adds a lot of interpretation. It's not a literal word for word translation. No. So basically, that's the problem. Is there, a, is there, a, I mean, do you want to, to have a read uh, in English translation? This is an English translation. Uh, this is an English translation. I'm English. Oh. My name is Robert. I'm not a Muslim. I don't oh, speak no. Arabic. I'm reading the Halali and Khan English translation. So actually, I can't, can't seem to help you on that. There's nobody here who can... Uh, what does uh, the uh, what what does uh, the, what, where, where are you where are you based at, at are you Manchester or uh, London or where? I'm Plymouth. What? Plymouth. Plymouth. Yeah. You need you need uh, uh, which is the nearest? I mean, Islamic centre. Is there any Islamic centre near you? Yes, there's one about three quarters of a mile down the road from me. I visited them. They were hopeless. They didn't really seem to be too bothered. Um, they didn't seem to know much about the Quran. They they weren't too bothered at all. Oh. No, no, no. Uh, Could you... About 400 miles. 400 miles? Yeah. What, what about London? Pretty much is uh, you're far away, isn't it? Yes. It's, uh, best, best is uh, what I can say is uh, ring the Islamic Center of London. I've, I've, I've done that. I can't get through to the one in Regent's Park. And East London Mosque hung up on me after about seven or eight minutes. No, Muslims no, no. don't seem to know very much about their Quran. They don't seem too bothered about it. What I want no. to know is, what does the Quran say about the previous scriptures, the Torah, Torah, and the Injil Gospel? Well, basically, the Quran says that <coughs> they are the only book, and they they they, they are true. They are uh, true true books given to the prophets, uh, uh, and. Uh, um, what they say, uh, people, uh, I mean, uh, the Quran is uh, the, what, it, what you call it, uh, uh, sort of more, uh, all put together is the, more, more, is the version of uh, all the book mentioned and what uh, the book says, the, it's in, in their life, in the Quran. Um. Why don't Muslims use the Torah and the Injil gospel today? 
if you believe that they are from Allah, their scripture, why don't you use them today? Why don't you have in your mosque the Quran and the Bible? The Quran is the final book. Yes, but the Quran yeah, doesn't... So basically, basically, uh, whatever is in Quran is, uh, uh, I mean, it's a translation of all the other books. I don't think the Quran is a translation of the other books. I think it's a new book. Well, that, that, that's, what, that's what we seem to understand, but we seem to... Uh, I mean, it's the indication of a prophet, all the prophets and their books, uh, there is respect and uh, for, for guidance are in the Quran. Why don't Muslims use the Bible today? Well, basically, they, they, they say, seem to say that the, the Bible uh, is, uh, in other words, cancelled and not in Quran. Uh, where does the Quran say the Bible has been cancelled? I, I don't think it says that at all. I think it says the opposite well, of that. That's, that's Could I finish I mean, my sentence? Could, uh, I, the, the, could I, mean, I finish my sentence? Like, like, like previous prophets, one book, like Abraham had ever something. Could and you? then Jesus had something. Isa had something. So, so that sort of thing what, what, what we read in. So in reality, uh, we believe in Quran and that's what we read. The Quran was given to the Arabs. The Quran huh? wasn't given to the Christians. The, Quran, the, the, could I finish my? Could I please finish my sentence? If we're going to talk, could you allow me to finish my sentence, please? Surah five forty seven. Let the people of the Injil Gospel judge by what Allah has revealed therein, and whoever does not judge by what Allah has revealed, then such people are the fasakin, the rebellious, i.e., the disobedient of a lesser degree to Allah. It says, Surah 547, let the people of the Injil gospel, that's me, I'm a Christian, judge by what Allah has revealed therein. That's in the scriptures. It's not saying the gospel has been done away. It's saying that Christians are to judge. In the 7th century, Christians had the gospel and they were to judge by what was written in the gospel. It doesn't say the gospel has been done away, sir. Well, that, that, that's what, that's what uh, uh, we believe, Muslims believe, that the final and clear version is Quran. I, I'm, not asking you, I'm not asking you about the Quran. That's not my question. My question is, what is the Quran's view of the previous scriptures? What does the Quranic text, read the Quran to me, what does it tell me about the Torah and the Injil Gospel, please? Well, basically, I, I, I'm not up to date on that. But what, I, I, what I've been told or what I've read is what I'm saying, and that's, that's, uh, that's my belief. I don't think your belief is important if it, if it contradicts the Quran. If no, your it's belief not is... contradicting the Quran. It's not contradicting the Quran. No. <coughs> then how do you explain <laughs> Surah 547? Quran, put it that way. How do you explain Surah 547? Where, where in the 7th century, the Christians, the people of the gospel, are told, by, are told to judge by what Allah has revealed therein, in the gospel. Well, that's it, isn't it? That's your version. Anyway, no, I'm, that, no, I'm actually I mean, reading I'm the Quran. That, no, no, I'm actually, I'm actually reading the Quran. Surah 547. I don't mean to say, um, uh, um, my... Mother tongue is Urdu, and I, 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 what I read in translation, that's it. So basically, I can't even even uh, um, translate Arabic. So basically, what I, I have to read Urdu. I can read Arabic and then translate it into English or Urdu. So basically, that's that. So anyway, what I your belief is, you, you and what all my belief is, with me, I will leave it to that, and uh, uh, you keep researching. You don't That's seem too bothered. You don't seem too bothered, if I might point that out. 
No, 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 it's not that bother, but, but I'm, I'm, as you are searching, I'm also searching, but my, I, I'm, if I'm not committed to my belief, then it's poor to win it. So should, everyone should be committed to their uh, religion. Could you pass my so, details on to a good English speaker who could help me with my what? question? Would you pass my details, my name is Robert, pass my phone number, my details, on to a good English speaker who could help me, please? Well, basically, uh, uh, I, I can't, uh, at the moment I can't seem to think, but uh, I've got this number. Uh, I'll try to give, pass it on to somebody. Yes, okay. if, you, if you would. Thank you, sir. Bye-bye. Thanks.